Yeah, he's a talented boxer indeed, isn't he? Very, very skillful, great amateur, and uh, very young. So Dan Garber's come in very late notice, hasn't he? So you know he, he'll just try and survive a few rounds here. Let's get it right. But uh, let's see how the timer carries on, and straight away he's goes with that left hand. Yeah, left hand straight through, arrowing over the top, just to slip no count at this point. Don't take your eyes off him. Don't blink. His five stoppages have all been in the first round. He's been the distance twice in Tama, but the stoppage victories have all been before the bell has sounded to end the first round. And let's do There's Garber just walking on to another one. Let's just make the point that he only took this fight on Monday, so fair play to him. His hands are getting quicker, he's got destructive power, and he's having a real fall there. Mark Bates about stepping in, he's going to let it go. The end feels close. It's Alba putting his punches together. He's a great finisher, we know that. Uh, just backs off here to be a little bit more patient, just when we thought the referee was going to jump in and stop it. There's a chopping left hand, and at the moment, he can't miss, can he? No, he can't indeed. All started off with when actually Garver made an attack, and, and Moses, the time, of caught him with a lovely left-hand counter, but it's every shot he seems to be throwing, he seems to be hitting the target. And yes, he keeps peppering with the jab, but you're just waiting for that big left hand to land. He's got really fast hands, he's a really good finisher. And every time we see him, the body shape is changing as well. He's got a new coach tonight in Alan Smith, a massive future. And he's really going about his work impressively here in the first round. Just setting it up behind the jab. There's again that left hand counter as Garber comes forward. His lead hand was just a little bit too low, made the mistake and the timer just catches him with a super shot again. You can't afford to make those type of mistakes against Moses the timer. Very quick counter, punch you with that left hand indeed. Still around a minute to go in the first. Barber walked onto the right hand there as yeah. well, a really sharp, fast, short right hand that caught him flush. There's another one in his own corner, clubbing left. And the referee's having a look again, and he calls it on far plates, calls a hold to it. It's another first round stoppage for Moses Itauma. And there was a real sense of inevitability from the moment the opening bell rung. Nothing that Garber could do to keep him off. And Moses Itauma gets another first round stoppage. You know, Garber may think that he could have gone on, but I'm not going to argue with the, the referee there. I think he jumped in at the right time because Moses Itauma was sort of hitting him with everything that he'd thrown. And he just showed a bit of class towards the end there. Ladies and gentlemen, at the time of 2 minutes 22 seconds in the very first round, your referee calls a halt to this contest. Therefore, your winner by TKO, Moses!